Okay, this is the Lancaster Leak Entry Exam. I don't know if this is a full game, a short game, a demo, I don't know. But I know it's a horror game. And we're gonna have some fun. Alright, uh, let's give it a go. Fuck it. Straight in. We are getting a feeling that you aren't taking us seriously. Bro, I've just got here. What are you worried about? No, no, no acknowledgement of missing Valor or tapes. Uh, we, le we are leaking. What? This time we dedicate to reveal something a little bit closer to home. An old screen recording of one of your training protocols. Uh... If she isn't released, maybe the next leak will show us will show how useless your training is. Does the agent body does the agent's body cam footage ring a bell? Uh body cam footage? Okay. Entity research department. Login user? Um Poop. Uh, Willy. Ha! <laughs> uh, required learning modules and practice quiz. Zero six complete. So we've got to complete all of these. All right, face detection, I guess. Oh, the sounds. Rowdy or D research. There has been one constant. Okay. What's that? Entities who possess human characteristics are the most violent, deceptive, and are the greatest threat to public security. Human characteristics, okay. It is imperative that agents have the skills to not only detect potential threats, but fast. I... BRD has found the one-year agent fatality rate goes down from 34.7 per 100 to 26.2 per 100 after taking this module and being proficient in this skill. Thank you. Okay, we, uh, we thank you for you telling us. Your cursor, click on the face in the image in the allotted time. Distractions may be employed. Okay, so we gotta find ones that are what, creepy or something? Begin. Okay. Are they going to be obvious? Oh my god! Why? Why? Why is that a fucking thing, man? Freaking Michael Jackson. I don't know if I meant to click on the face or just anywhere. Oh, there was two faces, I think. Right, if I saw any of these, I'd just let them kill me. I'd shit myself. Hi. Nice scream. You're not gonna get me. Where, where the, where's the face? That? Is that Cthulhu? What the fuck was that? Oh. Okay. Hi. This is the kind of face that you just see at night anyway. Yo, they single? They most certainly probably are. That guy. That guy looked odd. Okay! Didn't get to click in time. Oh, they're getting faster. Oh. Okay. Passed. Nice. Nice. Okay. First section's done, right? Sit wait, situation training. Get your sleep and date in your sleep paralysis paralysis demon. Can't get my words this out. This module has been created to address and rectify observed deviations from established protocols, reaffirming the essential principles that all ERD agents are expected to adhere to consistently. Okay. Lesson one, cert. What's CERT? CERT stands for calmly collect evidence, eliminate threats, run away, and terminate self. What? Given an interaction with an entity, these are the order of actions an agent will take during escalation. 
First, of course, is data collection, as research remains the okay. top priority of ERD. Second, eliminate the threat, unless such entity is on the preservation list. A dead entity can be studied, a dead agent cannot. If fighting back is futile, agents should run. If running is futile, agents should terminate themselves. <coughs> okay. Let's look at an example where an agent didn't follow the principles of CERT. Okay, we're going to watch an example. In 1989, Agent Redacted was collecting data on Entity 59 Skinwalker. Suddenly cornered, Agent Redacted fired all 12 shots of his service pistol into Entity. With no bullets left, Redacted was subjected to Entity 59 as rep. Remember to search, remember to keep an extra round. Okay. This video is another example. Think, following the values of search, what would you do? Okay. Search. Okay, remember in search. Oh, what's gonna freak me out here? What was that? Oh! God, oh, God, this body cam shit is horrific, man. I don't like it. It's creeping me out. Oh, God, shit! Jesus, fuck, man. Oh, my heart. Fucking hell. <sighs> Do's and don'ts. Improvements we need in ERD. Okay. Do's and don'ts. Interact with entities if new data can be collected. Don't risk losing obtained data by interacting too much. Uh... Help co-workers gather data. Don't become friends with co-workers. Do terminate co-workers who leave data. Don't hesitate. Explain what? later. Okay. Lesson three: Follow mission protocol. What is this game? Deviation from mission protocol endangers yourself, co-workers, and data collection. Assisting civilians is strictly forbidden unless stated otherwise in mission protocol. Reminder: The punishment for deviation is termination. So just deviating even one little bit will get me killed. Cool. In 1990, Agent Redacted was on a mission studying an entity. The entity was located at Agent Redacted's house. Agent Redacted tried and successfully saved his wife. Agent Redacted didn't follow protocol and both him and his wife were terminated. What?! This concludes the refresher. We will not remind about these topics again. See your supervisor if you have questions. Oh, I'm gonna forget this shit. If it comes up, if it's anything important, I'm fucked. The question quiz about these topics will now commence. Oh no. Oh no no. Begin. Okay. An entity has killed your partner, but is no longer exhibiting hostile behavior. What should you do? Collect evidence, eliminate threat, run away, terminate self. Collect evidence, I guess. Okay. It's a perfect time to collect more data! After a mission, an entity unknowingly followed you home. You have tried to shoot the entity, but your efforts are futile. You are cornered in your room. What should you do? Terminate self. Okay. Okay. You are carrying newly discovered data uh, 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 about an uh, uh, about an entity. You hear your partner upstairs cry for help. You know you could probably neutralize the threat attacking your partner. What should you do? Run away? No. Yes, run away. Okay, I've got the evidence. Okay, right. Okay. Do not risk losing collected evidence. You have a do not interf uh, interfere order on a mission studying an entity. The entity is killing civilians, one which is your friend. You have been given a weapon strong enough to neutralize the entity. What should you do? Record your friend's death for data. Jesus Christ, this is brutal. 
You overhear your, super, uh, your superior talking about a plan to leak data from uh, ERD. You are worried that you will be in trouble for solving the issue. What should you do? Do nothing. They probably know something you don't. Terminate your boss. Yeah, terminate your boss. Yep. Don't hesitate. Every second you uh, you don't terminate is another second. Uh, okay. Cool. Oh, cool. I passed. Cool. Just be a heartless prick. That's it. Heartless prick. Yo, I should work it. Doppelganger detection. Oh, no. Wait, wait, wait. We're nearly halfway there. Due to its emergence as one of the most common and dangerous entities, special training on doppelganger detection was created. Okay. Originally thought to be its own entity type, the doppelganger is rather a class of entities who visually and audibly mimic humans. Okay. Doppelgangers can be detected from their abnormal features. The most common attributes to look for are loose skin, missing features, and incorrect features. Further classification of the Pelvangers can be made by observing the abnormal features. For example, skinwalkers always have loose skin. However, identification is covered in a different module. Okay. So I guess I just have to point out the doppelgangers? Cursor, click on the doppelganger amongst the humans. Okay. I think some of them are going to be harder, aren't they, than others? Am I timed? Oh shit, I am timed. Missing eyes. Uh, 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 those eyes are fucking weird. Uh, this guy? Oh man, it might not be, but fuck it. Um... This fella, fuck. It could just be an odd looking man. Are you kidding me? Missing teeth? I don't know. Loose skin. Oh, fuck. They're gonna throw me curveballs, but fuck it. I know they're gonna start throwing me some curveballs. Okay. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, this person's weird grin. I don't know. Uh, this person! Oh, this person. This person for sure. None of them look up normal! Ah, fuck it! Oh, those eyes. Oh, no, 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 you! Shit! Did I get one wrong? They're getting faster. Okay. Oh my god, I got 49 out of 15. I got one wrong. Okay. I did better than I thought. I did a lot better than I thought. Woo! Alright, we're halfway through. Image, uh, rec, uh, recon, re, wait, recognition. Audio transcript and entity 101. And then we gotta take the exam. Okay. Nice setting the mood. His training module is to practice with reaction skills on determining if something is a friend. Okay. Or a foe. Okay. Answer in the allotted time, else it will be marked incorrect. Right. Begin. Wait, what? Threat, not a threat. Uh, not a threat. Give me the image! Oh my god, threat! That was the... Okay. Uh, not a threat. I don't see anything there, so no threat. 
Oh, f yeah, no authorized. Oh, what? Okay. Not a threat? What? It's just someone in a mask! Not a threat. Oh, fuck it. Yeah, threat. Not a threat. Threat. Fuck off. That's a threat. Not a threat. Threat. Not a threat. Okay, we got like two or three wrong so far. Threat. Holy shit. Where were these images found? Not a threat. Not a threat. How many images are there? Mm, not a threat. Not a threat. Not a threat. What? It was a dog, bro! Threat. Threat. Not a threat. Someone's gonna go now. Threat. Okay. Threat. Um. Not a threat. Qua 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 qua. Threat. I'm just gonna hang over one. It, the 50 50 chance of being right. No threat. Threat. That was a Bloodborne boss. Uh, threat. It's a fucking. What was that? Okay. Threat. Hi. Bye. Hey, I got most of them. Best. Nice. I got most. I got most. Okay. Two more little tests to do, then we got the exam. Okay. Audio transcription. And then NC101. This is going to be the worst one. It's going to be audio. It's going to scream in my ear or something. I swear to God. Yo, headphone users, watch out. Agents must be able to accurately transcribe audio coming from unusual sources. Please don't ask me to type. I'm a slow typer. Very slow. Besides being able to detect incoming attacks, agents must document what entities say during encounters, as research remains the number one priority. Oh no. Oh, no. Type into the console what you hear, and oh, press enter when fuck. complete. Shit. Begin. Um. The quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. I'm spelling errors. Do not look behind you. You are weak and replaceable. Okay. Clap, 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 cloudy. With a chance of rain. Everything is fine. 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 Yeah. Everything is fine. I don't see, 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 see the sun often. Not a clue. Don't leave me here. Yeah. Get out of my eyes. Get out of. My eyes. Uh, you're right now, Robert. Is to kill himself. Yeah. What? Okay. Yeah. 
I don't know what it said. Shit. Shit. Oh. I spelled that wrong. Please come back. Okay. He's come back. I'm so cold. I'm cold. Yeah. Someone's going to be horrible in a minute. Oh, what? Bullshit. <laughs> Some caramel digesters. Oof. Okay. We passed. Okay, we passed. We got two we got one more and then we got the exam. This is an odd game. This is a very odd, odd game. Entity 101. Entities are otherworldly beings that humans have been encountering for thousands of years. For once was a rare sighting, entities have begun appearing more rapidly through time. This led to the founding of the Entity Research Department. Okay. The RD goal is researching entities to protect the public but more importantly, finding utility in entities, and where they come from. The leading theory of where they come from is backdoors, yet no physical evidence has been back found yet. Doors. Okay. They come from the back room. That s where you come in. As an agent of ERD, you will be conducting highly confidential research missions to explore the gain of function of entities and finding their origin. This brief module will explain how entities are classified and show you the four entities ERD are focusing on in 1992. Two years before our born. Entities are given an ID but are often given a nickname. Some entities are given a class that link them to a family of entities. Entities are classified in three ways, threat level, containment, and utility each rated by five levels. Okay. Entity, E549. Nickname, Shadow People. Class, Doppelganger. Threat, Moderate. Containment, Extreme. Utility, Significant. Shadow People, or Night Terrors. Torment their prey during nights when there is low visibility, often in bedrooms, when the prey is sleeping. Paralyzing their prey during sleep, shadow people will ominously launch from a distance. It isn't known why shadow people choose to kill, as they will often torment the same subject for many years, but when they do, the victim isn't touched. To the civilian world it seems the subject died in their sleep. The research goal this year is finding out how shadow people choose their prey, and if this can be influenced. If so, E549 could be used in advanced interrogation techniques. Right. So torture is what I'm hearing. Entity, E718. Nickname, Matronic. Class, Machine. Yeah, a doppelganger, Low. literally fuck yourself, hell yeah. Easy. Utility, Moderate. Matronics take the form of animatronics. Playful figures that appeal to children. Matronics prey on children with no known case of an adult victim. 
it isn't known where Matronics bring their children prey, however, they are never seen again. Matronics, although dangerous, they are easy to terminate and capture. The past five years, agents of ERD children have been targeted by Matronics and have taken 107 to date. The research goal this year is finding why Matronics are targeting agent children and how to redirect their targeting. Okay. Entity, E59. Nickname, oh, Skinwalker. Class, Doppelganger. Threat, Severe. Containment, Moderate. Utility, Significant. Skinwalkers are ancient Shappa shifters usually taking the form of animals and uncommonly humans, stealing their skin in the process. Skinwalkers are incredibly violent and when killed leave behind nothing but their body vector. Skinwalkers have a hard time replicating the natural movements of creatures they take control of. Skinwalkers can often be identified by unusual eye size or loose skin. The research goal this year is finding a systematic way to identify skinwalkers 99% of the time and finding out defensive measures that can be taken to prevent loss of possession of body. Right. Entity, E59. Nickname, The Rake. Rake. Class, Null. Threat, Moderate. Containment, Moderate. Utility, Low. After the elimination of the Windigo, a new creature has seemingly taken its place in the Midwest of America and Southern Canada. Humanoid in shape, the Rake has varying size limbs but usually conforms to a white pasty color skin. Rakes hunt at night and humans are their favorite prey. Rakes are susceptible to gunfire, yet are incredibly agile and thus hard to shoot. The research goal this year is finding out the cause of their resurgence and the correlation after the Windigo eradication. Is there a point of taking out entities, if there is always a bigger fish? Anything else? A brief quiz will now oh begin. Oh no, god, I'm gonna not know off of this shit. Begin. What? Um, okay. Look at Walker, Skinwalker, that's a Rick. Shit. Um, that's... Uh, Metatronic. Uh, shadow people. S Civilian? What? Okay, it was a skinwalker. Okay. Uh, that looks like a skinwalker. Fuck! Okay. Keep going. That. Wait. The child of the engine has been taken in the What should you do? Follow it, find the origin, terminate the threat, run away. Run away? Fuck! I'm gonna fail this one. I have to retake it. What gives away that this entity is a skinwalker? The eyes, brother! Shadow people kill their prey after how long? Years. The Rick has a permanent mission. All you have to do is serve a pistol. You're able to terminate the entity. No, terminate self. What? I thought you always terminate the self. You have a child after watching this training module. You have learned your child is at risk of action. You should. Nothing. Failed. Study more before taking the examination. I've got to take that again. Well, shit. Well. I can't take it. Yeah, I've got to do that again. So we failed. Oh, wait, no. I can just straight up. Okay, fuck it. Let's do the comprehensive exam. Am I going to pass? The final exam will now begin. A mixture of content from previous modules. Okay. Begin. Got type shit in or something? Face. This one. Did you check the latch? Did you check the latch? NC is right in the appearance. What should you do? Collect evidence. Not a threat. 
one on the right, right? Oh, I typed it in a little bit wrong. Uh, yeah, we can imagine some mission. Are you in danger? No, collect data. Was that the first one I got wrong? That guy. Um. Terminate yourself. Just okay. It was all the same thing. Threat. Hundred percent a threat. Someone's gonna fuck me up in a minute. Choose the correct entity. Shadow people? That's shadow people. Your co worker who considered a good friend of this seems to be affected by something you want to save the world. And this is an example of which principle to keep you. Uh, do not befriend co workers. That was a trick question. Are you serious? There we go. Okay. Jesus Christ, some of the weird it's it's the uncanny valley stuff that is the most fucked up yeah the neck. No. Oh. Stink. Ah fuck me. I couldn't tell what that said. Uh, not a threat. Threat! Observe. Just observe. That's a rake. Shadow people. Face right there. That one. I think his mouth were upside down. Oh, threat. Ah! Woo! God, I'm good. Return to your supervisor for the next instructions. Excuse me. Stop watching before they find you. Jeremy Fisher. Is that it? Is that the end? Oh, yep. Okay. That, that. Is that it? Or is there more? Consider joining the Discord or newsletter and then it releases the next game that returns to the... Okay. Uh, okay! To be announced. Okay, so that wasn't the full game. That was just an entry exam. That wasn't the full game. That was good. I liked it. Nice little click thing and typey thing and shit like that. Uh, very eerie. I like it. I like the whole VHS kind of horror thing that's like kind of like become bigger in the last, what, three, four years or so. Like the whole VHS horror thing's become quite popular. I like it. I enjoyed it. Um, yeah, I recommend it. I thought it was really cool, and I think a whole game of this would be really, really, really cool. Yeah, awesome. Uh, next game.